Paglaw, we are back here at Youth Talk, <laughs> keeping you spiritually <laughs> connected. So, so yeah, uh, ano wala ko. Okay, anyways, uh, thank you very much at na uh, mga listener karong kahapunon. And we are very happy that you are with us. And I tell you, um, it's I know that you're learning. It's also fun with us here at the station. I guarantee you that we're just laughing and sharing moments here. And grab it. Alimot talaga on board. Dilip po. How dilip ay? Anyways, um, we'll we'll have the text na tay okay. uh, na tay comment na tay question actually. Hi, good PM sa inyo nga tulo based on my uh, based my own experience. I'm a guy nga no man dilip man magdugay ang relationship na mo. Okay man ako care sa iya ha. Wow. wow. So That's, basically, dilip your caring at tong lalaki nga uh, gapaasa. So uh-huh. we'll have another episode para uh-huh. sa mga babae uh-huh. na po nga gapaasa. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> so yun na na siya. Basically, para lang matouch to na to, I think uh, multifactorial man na siya, no? So, wow, I like the word. Uh-oh, pero unless ma-interview gin na to atong listener, uh-huh. makaingon ta, makapoint out ta. So based on the facts, di man po ta maka-assume uh-huh. da yun. Let's, let's, let's do um, siguro theory kung on sa mga factors. Let's, let's be... Yeah, uh-oh. it's possible nga na feel sa... Gr- when their relationship is really okay, uh-huh. and then suddenly he's caught off guard. Ngayon na kayo bulag man ang girl sa iya ha, nga mm-hmm. okay, magiging pag-care. Baka mang good na feel sa girl na uh, grabe kaya mag care si guy then di niya may reciprocate okay Possibly. wow oh. that, that's that's a very good point wow you're He, getting uh, wow. wiser you're, ha you're, you're, you're getting the point <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay well here here's what I'm thinking also um sometimes uh, when we do not understand the opposite sex or the opposite gender the person that we actually love kung dili ito makasabot sa iya sometimes we thought we care pero sakal na ito para sa iya yeah. wow yes. you're wiser okay. na po da <laughs> no 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 see, diba yesterday <laughs> mag-on check the hairs <laughs> in the hair you're setting the bars high for <clears throat> me <laughs> <laughs> I will okay. not explain it lang yeah. okay Paul go ahead Paul The, yesterday, Mangod, we talked about the differences between uh, gender, yeah. Mangod. So, Mona, you know, people. Uh, <laughs> Mona, nasulod na sa akong mind. Anyways, Paul, go ahead. Well, Mona, ito kung mayon, multifactorial. So, basically, <laughs> dagan gid siya. Uh-huh. And I Depende po if a uh, maturity sa girl. Uh-oh. Yes, that's true. Uh-oh. Basin day, ug dili po siya ready sa yung nanak intense ng relationship. Uh-oh. So, basically, musay away gid siya, no, sa kuan. Sige, go ahead, uh, Paul. And we also have comments here from our Facebook from cry cry ana siya sakit eh that's what others called friend <laughs> zone hanggang friends lang kayo and also from Marian May Montero hello hmm. Marian the uh, never hello. used talk researcher too you, oh, yeah. okay. hi Marian that's a hi. from G Clef ah okay uh, so uh, it feels confusing knowing that you don't know where your place is to someone you feel you are committed with uh, in the ending The more you share, the more you feel committed to each other, the more painful it is and difficult it is when it comes to separation or realization that the closeness you both have, which doesn't accord to the scriptures, must, must be stopped, for you are just friends. Mm-hmm. So the just best, friends. Mm, the best way to deal with it is to stay in the surface. You must stay behind where your level of commitment is. So That's very true. safe. Oh. That's true. And also from Abby Ramo. Also Hello, our Abby CC. Oh. Yeah, you stop uh, family. Well, obviously, it would be very painful for a person since his or her expectations in a relationship were not met. For that kind of relationship, the more a person expects, the more he or she will be hurt. So, yeah, so that's uh, they are really uh, sensible comments. Uh-huh. We have sensible ang, comments. Ang, ang ako asang concern, Magod, is like uh, there, should be, there should be a way, there should be tips that we could give to the ladies kung unsa ilang buhaton when that situation comes. Mm-mm. Diba? Kay, uh, sometimes um, it's not just the responsibility. I I know I agree with all that we're talking about. It's basically the guy nga mo yung initiate and the, the ladies are just responding. Now, that that cycle will actually be put off. Maputol na siya nga cycle if the lady does not respond. 
Mm-hmm. Diba? So, also, um, like we have kuya. to, we have to, kuan. like, ako, I'm a very, very kuya, mong good you I mean, you know me, basically. Mm-hmm. If I have people, nga kuya kuya sa ako, I take it so seriously and I put the bars higher Uh-oh. to the ladies, no? So, basically, ako ang, ako ang gusto nga ma-understand po sa ladies. Like, there are really guys nga pataka lang yun o sabuwag sa ilang emotions. Nga mura, mura o... Mura bita o... Saan eh? Seeds pa to... <laughs> mura gina na ba? Mag- bisan, bisan, bisan kinsa lang ang pwede Uh-oh. nilang mag-close and they're not being responsible to yes. their and own feelings. And take note, kapag namamang ka sa dalawang ilog, ba takot ka? Baka hindi na ilog pagbalik mo. Basta yuta na to. <laughs> so, yun pwede so, magbangka. Yes, ang akong, akong, akong basic point yun nga gusto na ko masabdan sa ladies is that Um, yes, the guys are there to initiate, but then you you also have a responsibility to, to stop responding. Yes, oh. yes. Because the next ane nila ng move would depend on your a uh, response to yes. the first move. Yes. So, so mo na siya. Ako wala magud ko y. Wala ko y sister bang. Wala ko y sister mm-hmm. nga babae. And I'm very concerned. Um, sometimes very mo na sa ako mga mga friends po nga they they. Um, gakuya kuya mga ina na they basically um, we set the I set the standard very high for them that when that comes when when that situation comes nga na ay guy that would probably try to win their emotions or frequent na ang kuan then I, I I usually advise them like you need to do something about it mm-hmm. because if you're not doing something about it then the guy would continue winning your heart and you don't know mo na siyang uh-huh. uh, mo na siya gitawag na to kagani you're unconsciously na. hurting yes you're yes. consciously hurting yourself as well mm-hmm. so, so let's siya. go now to the next uh-huh. uh, part now friendship that invites confusion and frustration yes. mm-hmm. I think this is more because ang atong definition when si Peter or si Leila lahi ilang pagsabot sa just friends. Mm-mm. Okay, yes. That's because kanang relative na definition sa just friends. So, dito ka balo kung unsa day ang just friends for the girl, just friends for the boy. So, it's so like more than friends but less than relationship. Yes. More somewhere I caught in in between. I was trying mm-hmm. I was about to say something pero dili na lang. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. So, intimate friendships between men and women almost always produce confusion and frustration for at least one of the parties involved. Nga no makang ma frustrate man kapag laom din po. Well, syempre kay Um, uh, most likely dito, dito sa girl nga part, di ba? So, hindi niya mag-gets why ka nang koan. Hindi niya mag-gets why nga nga no, inaniman. Very ka nang confusing. And a close friendships, um, by their very nature, tend to involve extensive time yes. talking and hanging mm. out one-on-one. They tend to involve a deep knowledge of the other person's hopes, desires, and personality, and of course, uh, sharing the many aspects of their lives. In other words, na sila intimacy. They mm-hmm. develop intimacy, mm-hmm. diba? Take and note, yeah. This should be involved only in relationship, most especially for marriage. And uh, take note, take note of the word one on one here. No, because there are a lot of friendship that actually shares the talking time, the hanging out, and uh, the knowledge of each other, but they're not one on one. So mo na siya ang atong parameter isang agina set. No, it's one on one, not oh, not bar. Yes, yeah, singling out. Yes, that's uh, no. the second one is um, it's easy for two individuals of the opposite sex to have completely different perspectives in their. Um, camaraderie, no. That's uh, that's why it's so important to have defined, defined relationships. Uh, there must be a clear demarcation line. Kung unsa lang yes. dito, or, or yes. else, may mo na sila mga dictionary diha. Oh, okay. Oh. Sometimes there's a hairline difference. Yes. Between kanang inana, kanang less than lovers, more than friends. Mm-hmm. And it's important, no. Especially be be responsible, guys. Um, it's important that if you're if you're so that you both know where you stand if you're just friends there's often confusion and, and just never, never sure, sure who's going to do what when if ever, ever. Oh, diba? so, usually kuya, diba, makaingon, for example you are the girl in the in that place Buhaton ka na kuni nga mura mag kuan dili ra ba mi uya yes. binana that's usually the And condition there kanang kanang say for example for special occasion especially karon na yulitide oh. season diba so maglibog ka oh, <laughs> <to> my, <laughs> hello unsa ako 
ka gift sa iya ha ihatag ka na ko ni sa iya gift sa iya ha basig mag-interpret siya nga kanang ma-misinterpret oh ma-misinterpret ko niya nga inuna na ang iyang kon or basig iyang interpretation kay uyob gud kay o kanang ina na gud ko oh kanang patay na patay kay ko oh basig feeling niya kay kanang Oh, ganang kay ko sa iya. Oh, murag ina na bitaw. And so basically, no, uh, like, like what I've mentioned just a while ago, guys, be responsible. Like if you have no intention of going farther in that relationship, make that clear. Mm-hmm. Seriously, make that clear to the person. Nga kanang less l- spend lesser time with the person. Plus, make it clear to the person, yeah, this is it. Like this is 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 it. This really is it. Oh, murag murag na siya. Oh, you can uh, spend uh, time with the person, but in groups. Yes, Why of course. In groups? That's true. Okay, no. another thing. The simple reality of which most people are aware, whether they admit it or not, is that in the vast majority of these types of relationships, one of the parties involved either began the friendship with, with the romantic, romantic feelings, feelings. Uh-huh. For the other person. So, unay isa nga una na hulog ang loob. Okay. <laughs> and then, oh, okay, I'm lost. Or the the one of them along the way. Mm-hmm. So, either way, that person is now hanging on to the friendship in the hope of getting something more despite the clear words. Yes. Uh-oh. From the other person that he or she wants nothing beyond friendship. Sometimes mga good ang um, best friend best friend opposite sex ng mm. mga kwan start <laughs> na nakatawa mm. yon. Um, <laughs> mga best friend best friend ngay na it starts always with the physical attraction. Uh-oh. Like wow man, this lady is okay. And the, oh, siyempre, di na gid ka first di uh, mga kwan. So murag ang ang isa sa dayon ang ang babay sa day. Wow, kanang mayo lagi ka na siya, no? Kanang mm. gwapo lagi na siya, mayo baro. Gwapo, gwapo oh, nga tao. <laughs> mayo baro, di ko kwan. So ina na siya nga mga situation. And then you tend, then you you've met, you've changed number, nag-exchange mo number, ana started texting or or you spend time with each other siguro sa, on a Bible study group or in the church or in a AY program and so what basically happens is uh, you spend more time you single out with each other and nahitabo na dayon is you started to develop a just friends quote and quote mm. uh, situation and then you end up breaking each other's hearts diba? so ang start yun ana most likely is the physical attraction like you get wow grab, grabe siya no ana and then mm-hmm. And then, um, for the lady, sometimes, wow, grabe na friend na ko siya, maikit to siya mo, storya, gwapo kayo siya, ina na, basketball player, ina na, <laughs> friend na ko siya ba, ina na. The, the, the guys had f- start to feel like, wow, she's, she's, you know, guys look at he, her, mura gwapo kayo siya, papanalaw sa uban niya. So, it feeds the friend ego. Friend na ko, oh, oh. Friend bien bien na ko, you're proud. Diba, oh, so, ina na siya. Another situation. thing also in this, uh, r- Uh, situation is when men initiate women respond mm-hmm. so, so what if a w- one person ang isa what if si Layla suddenly na develop siya into a romantic with a romantic feeling towards uh, Peter so na, na fall siya pero without clear words o uh, unsa ba yun sila Uh-oh. okay so what happens is uh She will likely feel that if she pushes for something more than friendship basig mawala ning amo ang ka- present na relationship nga intimacy oo oh. oh, oh. so the problem there sa para sa babae is uh, naglisod siya confused frustrated and unsatisfied with the person situation nalibog siya kung moderate ba siya move on ba sa ilang friendship or not yeah so mo na siya ang mga mga situations we have we have a reaction from our from from uh, sa ato ang hotline to sum okay. up all the causes of hurt pain and hatred in one word it would be expectations yes. <laughs> Grabe, no? we all shouldn't have too much of it um i think he's requesting a song anyways that's coming from uh winston thank you very much winston and we have another one hi thanks god uh All right. Anyways, uh, thanks God. I think she's listening. <laughs> anyway, so moto siya to more reaction. So let, let's go ahead with with what uh, would man initiates and woman responds. Now, certainly a man can find himself in a similar position with a woman, woman he's attracted to, but given his obligation to be clear and intentional with a woman and to initiate the type of relationship he truly desires, he arguably has placed or at least kept 
himself in such a position. He simply is not between a rock and a hard place in the same way a woman is. Mm -mm. Yes, so in in ana sa lisod no. <laughs> Sakitan. <laughs> Tanaw ni mo ba sakitan. <laughs> All right. Okay, and there's Pan another type of confusion to consider. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. How do others view your friendship? Uh -huh. uh, there's the concerned yes. citizen here. Uh -huh. The concerned citizen. Oh, kanang there's ha kailangan din natin emphasize. Ladies, might there be men who would have initiated with you but for their uncertainty about or discomfort with your intimate friendship with another man? So na ba yung mga nakita ni mo sayang na yun na mga deserving pa ng mga lalaki oh, oh. nga mag soon ta after you pero kanang I mean mag woo after you <laughs> but um kanang na kuan nila wala na, na dayun oo oh, oh, wala na dayun kaya nakita sila uy naman ni Shay close nga guy or mm -mm. kanang uya ba na niya si Tart na lang oh, so, when kanang, in fact dili mag ide ay oo oh, oh, dili ide yun and then guys has a woman perhaps turned you down over questions about a woman friend you spend lots of time lots of time with so would you want to date someone knowing that he or she had a significant pre-existing and going emotional band with another single member of the opposite sex uh, oh so Lisa no kanang especially example lahi ka nga girls Laila then there's another girl nga si Peter na ngoyab si Carla let's just uh, say no and then ko ikaw si Carla Ha, ano mangoyab man siya sa ako ang I think uh, he's going out with someone with uh, very close mm -hmm. uh oh and if I were a single person desiring marriage, the answer to these questions would matter to me. Oh, oh, listen. When there are other parties involved. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, another thing is intimacy without commitment spells, spells trouble. trouble. Oh. Uh, how do you spell that? No. So, five, uh, six, six, uh, six letters lang, pero intimacy without commitment na tamo na ang spelling. Oh. So, young people today often become emotionally close with the opposite sex without considering any kind of commitment to protect that intimacy. Sometimes, uh, kapag lang dims na, especially even high school students, yung mga gitik gitik din ha with the oh. opposite sex. Oy, okay lang man, friends me, oy, if i confront sa mga ate or kuya nga, oy, on saman mo. Dili eh, close way to be a good me. Oh. So, diba, sometimes, basin, wala gid sila feeling eh, more than friendship. Pero, um, this kind of intimacy, if especially ka nang murag, wala or sa ilahat first, they don't know ba, uh, they didn't know beforehand nga, they're spelling trouble. Uh -oh. Yes, and sometimes even agbay-agbay. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. We need and to be really careful about yes, that. Yes, even not, not just the high school students, even even um, mga mga college students na even with our AY yeah. outing sometimes ato mga Adventist youth outing sometimes they sit together as if they're sweethearts mm -mm. mga inana bitaw agbay agbay nga murag murag sweethearts and all that kind of stuff and this is these things should be avoided because you might be playing with say for example butan butan na to silag situation Crush day ka sa usa ka tao, di ba? Butan lang nato ina na nga Although AY AY mo niya crush day sa kasi sa ka tao niya. Ni HD. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hidden desires hidden or desire hidden feelings. Ba? Oh, so ni ag giagbayan ka. How would you feel? Uh -oh. Di ba? So mura po kag bayawon ug asa kag gibayo, di ba? <laughs> Oo. Oh, or say for example, a guy has something for you and then ikalit siya og agbay sa emoa and ikaw said you just allow it because uh, uh, we're, yeah, oh yeah, yeah we're just oh, friends oh. diba but then the guy is is having chances na day kay ganahan sa emoa i mean oh. we don't know those kind of situations know. but we have to be very careful mm -mm. oh dapat careful careful ka Okay, so you have to clearly define your friendship because if not, it will lead to undefined relationships. Oh, so negative <laughs> That's effects. true. Ba? That's true. Be conscious of your dictionary, my friends. Uh -oh. Okay. <laughs> Another thing, enjoying the convenient, delaying the good. Uh oh. So Sakitan. that's very strong. <laughs> <laughs> So let's assume, ha, for the sake of argument, that your intimate friendship is one of those rare jewels that is devoid of the potential for her uh -huh. condition. So we are saying here, even personally, I have friends, nga guys, nga. I am really sure nga kanang dira gid sila. Oh, oh, uh -huh. an nagi inana gid nga mga person, and then napoy uban siguro nga kanang kung kanang you know pod nga kanang mo sila yung mga potential ba nga ka uh, ng potential, ka ng potential donor. <laughs> donor of heart ba uh, <laughs> potential nga ma-hurt sila especially if dili kaga careful sa mga actions mm. 
Mm-hmm. So, kailangan na siya ni Moko. And, and there's another drawback to such friendships. So, they discourage marriage. So, kung, of course, there are rare friendships nga. Ano good siya? Yes. We have here, um, ano siya? Plat- uh, platonic. Uh-huh. Meaning spiritual. Uh-huh. I think it will be discussed later. And another thing is, Men and women who are not called to long-term singleness and celibacy have a strong desire for companionship with a member of the opposite sex. Yes. Oh. So, muna siya. This is good and right because kan part man siya of a progression toward biblical manhood and womanhood. Uh-huh. So, mm. kailangan lang gid careful, especially those who are not called to kanang long-term s- singleness yes. and have this spiritual give called celibacy. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, no. I, I mean, we we see that sa atong mga young people, do, do, those young people who wanted to spend more time on the opposite sex. So, makita na to sa diringa discussion. Mm. Yes, and uh, the, another thing is kapag laumche by offering a taste of the companionship and interactions that make marriage so satisfying, with none of the accompanying commitments or responsibilities entailed in marriage, intimate friendships discourage the pursuit of the grown up. God intended outlet for marital desires, marriage. <laughs> this is especially so in a culture and a church that struggles with a widespread sociological trend in its young adults known as perpetual adolescence. Mm-hmm. So dapat uh, sa ina ning stage ma train na to among young people. That's why we have this in youth talk because we wanted them to ch- to be trained to look forward into those uh, uh-huh. in, in future life especially in the marriage life now if we don't do this we don't see this um, in the biblical perspective now nga single pa sila then they're probably be less interested of getting married yes kasi ang ano dira ang drawback is if you are kanang youth youth ka you are sometimes very naive uh-huh. so there is knowledge deficit nga kanang wala kakabalo so yes. kanang later on wala kakabalo nga ah, na hurt na di ay ka so that's why uh, we want you here to be informed as much as possible mm-hmm. to avoid uh, kanang unnecessary hurts okay all right um i think we're so, so the next thing that um uh-huh. we would like to talk about is women women guard your heart and men too Oh, mm. so fair a bit, good point. Man, you have to and guard your heart. Oh, we were joking, di ba, kagabir siya nga. If you want to, kanang to unsa ni have a secured nga life or as a wife, yes, you, you marry as a security, security guard. guard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we are reminded, mga kapag laom, maskin mga ladies ta or the gentlemen, to not. Uh, get emotionally close with someone else. Nga dili pa in the right time. As uh, we mature, it's a it anang dili naman siguro maayo nga. Oi, kaya gusto ro gugu mag uyab uyab karon asin yes. kaniya ako uyab. But next kaniya pod siya kaniya pod siya. Mm-hmm. We're like adventure lo gay ni. When we get uh kanang older na betawan <laughs> gakaidad gakaidad. I don't think it's really right to do such thing anymore. And even when we're still younger, in Songs of Solomon 8:4 it says, "Young women of Jerusalem, promise me never to awaken love before it is ready." ready oh. mm-hmm. And above all, in Proverbs 4:23, guard, guard your, your heart, heart for everything, everything you, you do flows from it. Gabi, chorus good. Speech choir. <laughs> and another thing is, uh, please understand that there is nothing that will stir up or awaken love in a woman's heart like emotional yes. intimacy and spending time together. So, the more you spend time with a woman, ma- ma- cultivate good ang love sa iya, which will point out sa atong discussion paghapon sa gender differences nga mm-hmm. women or kanang ilahang orientation or sense of self is towards relationship, yes, communication. communication. Mm-hmm. So Acceptance. eventually, if you spend time with a woman, so makaingon siya nga ma fulfill by the young sense of self. So oh, muna update, siya. update mm-hmm. ka sa iya so, for oh, me. And it's the little things that open her heart, like to our phone conversation. Nag-iuban ngayon na makalas. Diba usually kung uyab mo, tapos to our conversation would be, kanang okay lang. Pero kung the normal nga, kanang friends nga, kanang Ay, casual. Na. Oh, ah, oh, okay. Um, ah, amaw sige. ba? <laughs> Magana na lang, diba? And then, um, af- uh, mga afternoon movies or burgers at your favorite drive, riding to church together and whatever that is, moment mm-hmm. by moment. 
But uh, if na magayate mga kapag lao, mga kapag lao, dimple na horror listening right now, kung si Lugar, di nalagi rin mo dulog lalaki kung oh. girls me. Actually, this, that Muni is not the point. Muni ang paminawon oh. sa third nga point kapag lao siya. This doesn't mean we should run from the opposite sex yes. friendships. Uh-oh. Because mm-hmm. it's really okay if we have friends, man. The important thing there is we should guard our hearts mm-hmm. and future marriages by avoiding intimate one-on-one time yes. with people of the opposite sex. Mm-mm. So, okay lang, is, especially if you're in a group. Mm-mm. Diba? Consider keeping your relationships with the opposite sex, brotherly or sisterly, just like in Timothy, treat older women as you, uh, as you would your mother. And treat younger women with all your purity as you would in your own sisters. Mm-hmm. So, s- the Christ-like manner lang gid po na atang ipairal. So, we need to protect each other here. Okay, so protection. Or like this, W Dino. Yes. Okay, so, so we have we have a question here that we need to ask. So, all right. So, um, are friendships with the opposite sex even a good idea? Okay, that's a very interesting Aww. kapag laom uh, kapag laom Ray. So we will talk about that after this uh, wonderful song for all of our listeners right now. <laughs> 